Sonic Samus, mm -hmm. I would expect, and we are going to. I, I've seen uh, Afro's Afro's uh, matchup chart. I, I think he considered this quite even, um, or even Samus advantage. Uh, can keeps uh, Sonic out pretty well, um, and there's a pain for Sonic as well sometimes. Okay, so uh, is so I would assume that that means that. Zare can hit Sonic out of Spin Dash and Spin Charge. If, I believe if, so, if you, yeah, if, yeah. If you throw it out and they decide to let go of Spin Dash. And it might force them to shield, obviously, of course. And then Sonic kind of has to commit to a close option. Or retreat back even more. We're good, we're good, we're good. Please don't get stretched. Not like this. <laughs> I, I kind of wish I knew what the set count between these guys are. I I'd imagine it's quite close. You might see a quite an opposite set from the last one. It might be a bit more slower paced. Um, yeah. Sonic sets tend to be like that because you don't want that 20% spin charge coming in, dash whatever. And speak, speaking of Sonic sets being like that, they fulfill this. This game currently is fulfilling all of the criteria to become one of those because we have Sonic with a life lead and a healthy one at that, almost 100%. So Ixis is going to be just happy just to take 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 to going through his shield, jumping on the other side finding his way back to, to, to the ground at some point, using the platforms as well. Oh, catch him perhaps trying to spin shot out of there. Oh, I think he might have been going for a turn Oh, he's not dead. A turn around charge shot, I'm not too sure. He tried one there, didn't quite work out for him. Got himself tagged with an up smash, and that is going to be a hefty advantage for this Sonic player right here. Oh, 9.5%, wow, it gets that up air as well. Afro just contents the charges, the charge shot. Oh, it doesn't punish the whiff grab. A space dash attack. Finding himself an advantage anyway. Okay, so X is creeping up below that nair. And getting, getting his off a grab. Oh, oh punish the there! Wow! That was a clean two stop. It's so fast! Something about... There's something really beautiful about the hat, like when Sonic jumps off stage to raw back air you, yeah, and falls below the stage and gets you. And there's something like you see him drifting, gliding through the air, like like some sort of ice skater, like some sort of figure <laughs> skater, and then he catches you clean in the jaw, and then you die, like, stupid low percent because you, you might have burned your jump <laughs> like an idiot. Yep, but yeah, X is catching on to that set, uh, grapple. Tether recovery. Gonna get in that game. Here we go. Game two now, same stage. Okay, we're seeing aggressive Ixis right now. Pushing his advantage even further. He takes, but he takes himself down to the ground. That's the kind of thing you'll see. The moment he can get down to the ground, he will do. Not like he's a little Mac or anything, but. <laughs> Again, reset the neutral with both players on the ground. Uh, too far away for um, Dash Attack to be unpredictable there. Yeah, and that's, def that's definitely calculated, you'll find. Touch spot dodge, but he's still in a bad position. I feel like Afro really needs to get this charge shot involved. He hasn't hit Ixis with, like, one. Yeah. No, I don't think so. So, Ixis has... Is that there? Cross up. No. So, Ixis has really no reason to fear it yet. However, I do think like, do you believe in the long, the long meta conditionings? Whereas, like, if you've had a long set with somebody, yeah. like, the conditioning persists in the games. Yeah, I think that is a thing, definitely, especially for people who uh, play each other often, because you really want to surprise people at that point. Really save like your home run shot for the last minute sometimes. So, uh, Ixis with a grab, not enough to kill though. Nah, no. you don't have the back throw like that. You used to. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> right, safe pressure from Ixis. How's Afro gonna get off? He has to re grab. Wow, yeah. He Ixis did get that shield up, but drops it. Ixis is showing his recovery just the right amount of respect to make Afro Smash reluctant to go prepare off of the ledge. And Ixis is just walking backwards a little bit. And Afro really just didn't know what to do right there. Oh, there we go! There's the charge shot. And he's gonna take a stock with it. He put himself in a position to sort of react to spin, uh, spin charge. 
It's a good dash with his charge shot. Yeah. <laughs> so that was really good stuff from Afro there. And immediately after oh. that, there we go. Now, 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 X is going to start shielding a bit more in the neutral, allowing Afro smash a little bit more of a mix up, get some more grabs. Now, then mix it up with dash attack. That now the, the match starts here. Oh, Ixus has been taking a hint off Heli, so we saw we Heli has been doing this for about a month. Uh, up air, short hop up air in the neutral. Yeah, really, really nice and safe for Sonic. It's so mad how like you th it feels punishable, but it kind of isn't. <laughs> yeah, kind of mad. Scoop them up really well. Yep. Scoop up, and if you hit them with it, it's really nasty. It can lead into some, some really nasty up air follow ups. Chaps now the percent where it works. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Afro's nice try Ooh, to land. Oh, that's for jab grab that time. So what's going on there? Anyway, we have a pretty close game here. Uh, compared to the last one, Afro does need to find his way in though. Change oh. things around his favor. Let's it rip. But he lands in time to shield the follow up from Exus though. So Afro Smash has to be so careful how he presses the punish. Falling wow. up here, up B. Thought that was gonna take the thought that was gonna take the game right there. He was ready for it. Up B is actually deceptively quite weak if you do it really well. <laughs> that that stuff is cool. Oh neutral air! Wow! Calls out that quick ledge jump option. Always catches me by surprise. Mm. How, how strong that move actually that is. That big bounty hunter boot, man. <laughs> oh, okay, he stays behind his shield, I like it. Yeah. And Afro Smash as well, happy to stay in shield and not try it, not unwisely try and punish any of those options right now. Up beat! Yep, chases him up, but uh, Afro correct, correctly guesses the 50 50 right that time. Oh. Afro Smash didn't give him an air dodge right there, oh. he took an air dodge. Yeah, oh, he doesn't get the sweet spot though, I don't think. Putting the bomb at the ledge, oh. just giving him something to think about. Oh. Okay, cross up back here. So, the, the good thing about this matchup before Samus, I suppose, is that. Sonic's anti-air game, sort of, he needs to be coming out of spin dash already, or like already in the air. And, yeah. Um, so, if Afro Smash can throw out cross up on his shield, like cross up buttons, and there we go, letting it rip again. Now he's, it's all going better yes. for Afro Smash since he started getting nice. charge shots out. Throwing them out, and now it just has something to think about. I'm going to take that one there for I kind of I like how he put the morph ball bomb there, and it kind of like it's trying to go around the morph ball. Um, but that nicely placed up tilt does hit slightly below ledge. That's going to be a dead Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> Could you imagine that spikes like Falcons? <laughs> it, it only spikes if you're on the ground. Weirdly enough, so you have to be on the ground to get spiked. It's really weird. But does, that mean, does that mean you can then just like one, tech it and punish Samus? Go! Yeah. yeah. That's so bad. <laughs> anyway, we're at 1-1 one, one Yeah, right but now. it's a really good tour on the ledge. Yeah. But yes, 1-1 uh, one, one, like you said. Uh, pretty close stuff actually. That game one was quite one-sided, but things have changed quite differently now. Nix oh. is taking a quick two hits, running away exactly what he's doing uh, that like he's supposed to do. Looks like Ix is uh, SDI'd up on the up airs. He can actually just get out of them. It's quite sad for Samus to be honest. <laughs> yeah. Okay, the double bomb mix up. There we go. Uncharged charge shots. We like those too. We like <laughs> those as conditioning tools. I see you jabs me right there, but <laughs> don't, 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 yeah, don't, don't worry about follow up at all. Now he's Afro Smash quite happy to play play with his back to the ledge. And, and then proceed forward while Ixis is in recovery from whatever approach he was trying. And Ixis doesn't really feel like he's got enough of a percent lead to consider not approaching that. Yeah, yeah. Not much uh, distance in these guys that much now. Goes for that drop zone back air. Yeah. However, that being said, Ixis does not just camp. He doesn't just camp. He plays a, a like a hit and run kind of stuff. Mm. So he's he's not going to sit there and not do anything. And wow, that set that that up air is going to take that first Short stop. Short hop up air. There it is. Bring into up air. Yeah, yeah. There we go. There we go. Ooh, just barely missing that grab. We good. We good. I almost caught him again with that. Wow, there's so much shit lag on that. Sonic has a lot of good moves. That's not the best. There's so much end lag on it if 
you sh if you uh, if it whips. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah. There we go. There's nice. the, there's the bomb into up tilt at the ledge again. Um, so only if it whips. But the the problem with it is, is that you've got to be ready about it. So most Sonics don't use it like yeah, that, that really? much. Oh, a couple of times he's, he's been a bit too early on that dash attack on the ledge. To be fair, he might be trying to get a jump from the ledge, um, but it can be used to catch the standard gap as well. Uh, X has done that quite a bit. I wonder if he'll uh, catch on to that. Maybe wait for the next one. Yeah. But Afro finds himself on the ledge now. Dash is past. Just jabs him once in the face. Tell him, don't try, <laughs> don't try and run through him. Oh, he waited for an option there. there he comes right in with the spin dash. Pressing him while he's up here on the platform. Down smash not quite going to take it there for Samus. Oh, that is so nearly connected. All of these trades aren't working out in Sam in uh, Afro's favour. Set him out with the F tilt. Up B. Wait for the air dodge. Catches him with the up air, what? and that is two one two. Oh, is that is the kind that kind of situation oh, that really much. Samus. What I would like to see is I would like to see like if he's not gonna air dodge, if he's if he's if he's going to wait and he's going to pull it out, yeah. use the bomb to change because his momentum. A little it bit. could potentially might, do he, something. Yeah, that might work for him so he can like bounce in one direction or another. He might even be able to get a punish. Maybe, maybe. I'd, I'd love to see an upbeat like, to read the fact that he's trying to read the air dodge. <laughs> that yeah. actually be lit, <laughs> but it's so risky. But either way, <laughs> we are into uh, game four now. I say it every single tournament, an Ixis set, I commentate. I would love to see Ixis just go for a spring ride just one time. <laughs> oh, he locked him! He got locked with the dare. I'm surprised he didn't go for some sort of falling up air extension. I don't know what, some, I don't know what that... Samus has after it. He could have done a falling up air into something, but he, he, he's the one who's in top 8, not me, so. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go functional jabs. Hey! There's that Nair again. Now, here's where Ipsis here's where has lost most of the stocks to that up to Yeah, yeah. Exactly, actually. There's the Zare. I like seeing that. I like nice. seeing Zare ripping Sonic out of Spin Dash. You can see how Ixis wanted to really get in from that Zare pressure. Ixis will not stop neutral get using neutral get out. <laughs> like, I don't know. There's a mind game going on here somewhere. But he will. He's given him the neutral get up every single yeah, time. Yeah. It just seems to have been on that for a smash to uh, miss time his uh, punish. Wow. There's a punish on the landing though with that. I don't think it was even fully charged, but nearly, but it was just enough to get that stock. Nice answer with the down tilt. This is looking really solid for Afro Smash right now. He's he's got a uh, stock lead. Uh, he's getting extra credit, and as well as that, he's got that charge shot on deck, meaning that at any point he can just put a little bit more on. If he yeah. Gets a bit too uh, fresh with his approach. I'll be up here. There you go. Oh, that must be true. That mixing. must be true. <laughs> I think he, that was a mix-up. I think he just did it straight away. Ah, oh, okay. Solid. Uh, good answer back from X is right there. He's gonna put himself right back into this game now. Afro Saturn Smash seeming quite pensive about jumping off the ledge right there. Oh, thought maybe maybe I'll hop off. Oh, I hate seeing that. I hate seeing that so much. <laughs> what did he just clank through? Charge shot. Clank, clanking, clanking, clanking yeah, yeah, yeah. projectiles. Um, oh, oh he went for it. Goes for the spike the lunge. <laughs> he all cancels that there. Ix is trying to get into maybe corner ship. Gets dash attacks. Okay. So what Ix appears to be looking now are Afro Smash short ops and neutral. He's trying to he seems to be trying to catch them out with spin chart or spin dash, sorry. So and that seems to be the time, those seem to be the times that Afro Smash is getting caught. Because Afro Smash, let's face it, I don't think he really wants to roll. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's always a risk when you roll a Samus. Uh, it's so reactable. So punishable. It's too high now for that one. Oh, oh he gets it! Wow! Catches him with a dash attack, and that is going to end the set. Sending Afro Smash out of the tournament, Ixis moves on in loses bracket. It's such like a rare option, because a lot of Sonics don't consider that to be a, an overly great move. Yeah. But, you know, it's a really active hitbox. I guess he just knew he was going to stand and get up.